Hello, hello. This is Comrade Sirius, and as you can see, I've been playing with terraforming tools because we still have those dozers, right? And all of this jazz. So I just made a basic outline of what future railroad might look like. So I have this space reserved, and I wanted you to see it before I click this thing because this will not be built for a long, long time. But it's good to have it planned, because we need to be able to join it. At least to this. To this custom to this custom house. And as I as I'm looking it looking at it, it's probably not the best I could do. So maybe a little wider angle. So it's more it goes more smoothly. Down there. Well, that's it. Here we go. What is our today's plan? Well, as you can see, road is being built. I think I can also make some... Well, <laughs> it's almost a shortcut. Well, but let's do this. Let's do this and... Yeah, might as well. Just join it somehow. Because this wide circle will be our main road to the city so that's one this is second this is third these two could could definitely be joinable together yep they are and let's go four and three highways let's go for it and build it uh, i'll just put the game on pause because there's a lot of things we can do and the brown car has already disappeared, so we do not see much. But contours definitely do help. We can and will need a concrete bridge over this part. At least as part of future plans, so... Let's do it. And I'm thinking about, you know, tur turning, this, uh, turning this a bit. I don't know what I will do at this part, but probably cutting road straight through is not the best idea. Because it severely limits of what we can do with the space. Because I will I will probably need some fields there. Some fields there anyway, so... Well, uh, this one is not great, but that's the... Are those stones right under it? Can we make maybe do it from a, a little different point so those stones are not there? It's still not ideal. I can always use, use you know cheat mode and just lower the, lower that terrain a little bit under it. It's not something I'm I would be. I would like to do, but it might happen that, I, that we will need it. Okay, so this is the this is the road. Now, how do we get to the city, and what roads there will be in the city? More importantly, I think I'm pretty okay with having a bigger crossroad at this point, at this place. And have and having like a, wi a wider road swinging through here and to the city and to the city center. I have no idea how I want to play how I, how I want to play it. I haven't been thinking about it much. So let's just wave it somehow and then adjust. And I'm don't I'm not sure if it if it's the best thing to do, but hey, we can do, we can at least try here. We will have some something that I call a road triangle because that's it's much more comfortable for cars to t turn in. But now I want to, but I, now I want to have it built as fast as as, uh, as fast as we can. What we need to have built is at least this part. So for one and hey guys, let's start moving. Because they can start move, they can start building this road, right? And you can see they are already going.
which is good. What we need for the city. So, aside from buildings, which will be everywhere else, and it will probably be the largest brick flats, because what else? We needed some kind of grocery store, maybe a small shopping center. This one can serve 150 50 visitors. This is one. The second one, well, it's only 105, and it's only yeah, it's only those small stores. 405. 224. This one is a really good deal, like it or it seems it does small amount of steel. And also has quite a good storage for meat, or at least two tons, which which is huge in my opinion. That's a really good that's a really good deal. And I will place it right right across this bus the this bus station, or is it a good idea or not? I don't know. Well, we are on 300 meters like here, so we need it closer to this point. So I'll just place it here, so we can have some some sort of square, uh, some sort of square around here. That's a shopping center, and you cannot see shit, I suppose. Well, we can as well, if if we read it, we can as we can as well just pull this out a bit backwards because we do not need that long that long of a road, and we can build this one. I'm sorry, I may have lost some gravel, but we can keep this space tight, and so you know cars won't go through. And keep those walk walking distances, you know, short. Because this space is not that huge. So it's Okien, Okien Supermarket. We don't have any new city names here, so it's all Harlinden, but I'm not sure how how long Harlinden can be, so well we'll come up with some name. Ideal from Lord of the Rings as well. For pub, we would need, or I would like to have a pub, at least. We don't maybe need it desperately, but it's nice to have one. So let's place, let's place it here. We can have a cinema. Oh, we need some culture, so it's probably a cinema, because there's nothing else here. But cinema doesn't need to have a road connection, right? Is it correct? I think so. Well, it can have. Just that's the other, that's the other way of looking on it. It can have, and we can have some sport. And I'm really thinking about using some tourism for the first, let's say, five six years, because it can bring in some money, and. It's a good way to utilize your productions if we are able to to make them work, which is something I'm definitely not sure about, not sure of. Well, let's com let's complete our our city center. Well, the po the pool can, but, but the pool doesn't need to be there, right? The pool needs to be somewhere somewhere, but it doesn't need to be. Uh, that's what. So maybe we can. We can place it here, as long as I am able to swerve this route out, and I will be. I'm not. I'm obviously not building it because that would be silly. Well, we can let it play. So that's for sport, right? Now we will need a road somewhere here. So let me just draw it as a line, and this one definitely needs to be. Needs to be attached. What else do we need and we do not have? We need emergency services. We need hospital. Hospital is probably good to have near the near the station because people will need to walk there. Or will walk there if if they need. That's probably a better way to. That's probably a better way of how to how to say it. So let's maybe let's place it 
right here. Interesting thing about hospital is that it has really big walls. So these mo so monuments, which we will have, like you know, this um, this Soviet emblem, they don't look as hideous in front of these walls, like 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 anywhere like, like somewhere else. So maybe we can put this put this one n near next to the superma supermarket. I was originally thinking about the smaller one next to the hospital, but well, this one will do its job as well. And 145 meters is definitely not a bad, bad one, and it will cover a decent area, because we cannot have the largest ones with with the large radius of cover coverage. Taras Sevchenko from the Ukrainian DLC. I probably expect everyone ha everyone has it as well. That's a sort of exception, and we can definitely place him. We can have a pop by Taras here because no walkways will be here anyways. So it's just a Taras pop by Sef Shevchenko. Why not? For emergency, it's not only hospital which we placed here, and let's not forget and. Actually, just swerve the road around so we do not box ourselves out. Because it can happen really, <laughs> it can happen really easily. The pool doesn't ha doesn't need the road, but this thing definitely does. Uh, more importantly, hospital. Uh, there's a way out. Hospital definitely needs stand for for you know for the big garbage bins. So I'll put it here because. <laughs> They will. It will produce some hazardous waste and things like that, and we definitely need to be taking that into account. Every other building will need some waste management as well, and we'll look into it, but not in this episode. Probably in some of some of those next. But we need fire station. That's what I've been thinking. Probably this one for only two vehicles is enough for a start. You can have either big stations that are that will cover a la large areas and you know have fire helicopters here. We do we cannot buy fire helicopters because we cannot buy helicopters and trains. We need to manufacture everything on our own. So yeah, kind of not kind of not doable. It doesn't matter. But we need the fire station anyway. To be present, and I think I will just place it somewhere here on the main road because it doesn't need to be in the city center. Definitely doesn't. It needs to have range, so and it will. So maybe somewhere next to this future crossroad, future bigger, bigger crossroad, so the fire station has has coverage, or maybe. Here, because we will need to divide this anyway, and send another send another road to, to the to another city part this way uh, somehow as well. Yeah, that's also a do that's also a doable thing. Okay, so that's fire. That's fire. Then kindergarten will be placed with pe with people, school as well. Orphanages we do not. We do not want now because we won't have people to man them. We need a we need a university, and there's only one cheap option to start with, and that's the small headquarters of the party, and it will produce it will produce some nice things for us, like distribution offices. They will research it. I know many people don't like it. I kind of do. I do like I do like this research. Well, this is a square. For, this is a square for us. So making university across across the pub and making this a square is also nice. Not a plaza, some place to walk on and enjoy your culture and so on. I think that will look good. So that's a university, and we need a school. We can join. We can join school. As well, I don't know how many kids we need. We can go with maybe the smaller, smallest one, and hope it will be enough. 
And it probably will, that's the magic about it. The funny thing is that it all schools do eat prefab panels and we have only limited imports of, of imports of them. So maybe well let's put it side by side here. School and the university, like something like a small school a school district. And we'll see what it do what it, we'll see what it does. We can expand the city any way we like afterwards. Crime and justice we do not need. We do not need police, st police stations. We do not need guards, prisons. Because this thing they will come they will come in after we reach seventeen like two thousand two thousand people. And definitely not important right now. How is it looking? These guys are fast, so yeah. Just build me this road as well. Because why not? We need to keep them moving, that's why I have slow speed. Because time is not an infinite and we need to accomplish a lot of things before we get to some proper gameplay. Because this campaign is time is limited in time a bit. I can well, these probably can build can be built by our trustful our trustful losers and well we'll Send them here as well because there's a lot of gravel to be used. Also, now only only people. Hotels are I'm not building now because these small they really don't have a lot of a lot of tourists to be built. And this one has brakes. This one has prefab. We do not want to build the prefab one. Hotel Ukraine. Oh, that's a big one. The thing is, I, what, I, what I'm what I'm thinking now is that we are allowed to have only one hotel running after six after years between year sixty eight and and year nineteen eighty nine, where the Worldwide Revolution occurred in history. This is interesting because if we will build a big hotel, that can bring in a lot of money, but that will cost a lot of people to a lot of workers to fully utilize this thing. I am absolutely I have absolutely zero idea if it's if it is a good idea or not. But hey, maybe we can find out together. Because I will need to do something. But we have the we have the city basics and so let well so let's go with residential areas. Now I see better where the edge is. This will not stay here, but it it is there now. So let's go with some houses. This is the here will be two of those because we will definitely need them. I can just build something of a something like a road here around. Quarter to be left in. Yeah. These are five. We need around ten because that's fifteen hundred workers almost. And <coughs> it will take some time to research anything else than these brick houses. So keep keep this in mind. As long as there will be a crossroad anyways, so I will build probably I will just move those houses a bit. Ah this this will be good. A little waterfront living. That's six Seven, eight, nine, ten, and I think I will. I think I will finish this in 
sort of square shape. It's not ideal and definitely I I have definitely missed this missed this one a bit, so yeah, just I will just turn it around. I don't know what I will use this space inside for, maybe another kindergarten, or maybe not another, we don't have any kindergarten, so it's probably a good space for it anyway. This one doesn't need prefabs, this one does. This one does as well. Well, maybe place a small one. And now, now we need, before we conclude this episode, we need to place some waste collection bins. <clears throat> this here it is tricky with the shopping center because that one will definitely need need its own. But I have no place to fit fit them right here, so I probably will need to move this road a bit, which is doable. That's why that's why are we play, why we are planning in this this mode anyway so yeah exactly like this yep this will do and now standard bins because people do not need super large ones anyway where are we going to put it? We may place them next to, next to the road. Roads do not like placement of things. It's, it's not great. These people won't like it, but well, we are not here for liking of people. And we are not building it with, building it with, with, with that in mind either. There will be one. This will definitely be able to walk there. So I'm not... I'm not that afraid about it. What about here? The kindergarten will need... Will need some. We can just maybe... Yeah, we can mirror, mirror this so... People can walk in. We are here, th there will be road. Now, yeah, we can place another one here. Place. And that's it. Now only this, maybe these two. That should be easy. Just across the street, because here will, or maybe something. I don't know what. But we will definitely use this space in one way or another. And I will definitely bring bring a road here I'm not sure about what are we going to connect to this road but city should have roads we can just place you know something like a sub an electric substation or anything, anything similar to it or we can do it we can do something completely different I have no idea and that's not important the important thing is that, that this road is almost complete and these, these machines are working and are supplying what we what the city needs. So that's city plan that's our city planned. Will I hope I will see at least some of you next time and that we'll figure out what that we will figure what are we going to do. With all of this, and yeah, eventually I can just pull something like a bridge over here, and to mark this idea, I'll just, I'll just do this thing. Yeah, I don't need it, and I don't want to build it right now. But it's good to have some reminder of the possibility before I'll block it with some complete non nonsensical idea. Those who do not know me, which is probably most of uh, most of you, I'm definitely capable of doing such doing such things so have a nice day and see you next time